Okay, so for today's video naman guys, um, pag-uusapan naman natin yung Cartesian Plane and its Coordinate System. So, kung bago ka pa lang dito sa channel natin, so please do uh, consider subscribe at para mas mamotivate pa rin tayo gumawa ng mas maraming video. Okay, so without a further ado, let's start this. Okay, so ipapakita ko ngayon ito, itong meron tayong familiar pa kayo dito, meron tayong uh, quadrant 1, quadrant 2, quadrant 3, and quadrant 4. Okay, so may mga symbol pa rin yan sila, at isa din yun sa mga lagi nating tatandaan. So may nakita kayo dito, plan point, okay, plain dot, together with their um, coordinates, okay. So, ayan. So, yung center point natin dito, yung zero dito, sa pinaka-center ng ating uh, Cartesian plane. So, tinatawag natin yung origin. Okay? Origin. So, that is the origin. Now, so, for quadrant 1, this consists of uh, positive and positive. For quadrant 2, negative, positive. And for quadrant 3, we have negative, negative. And for quadrant 4, we have positive negative. So, saan ba galing yung positive-positive na yan? Okay, bago, na, bago tayo mag-start dito, so, explain natin kung saan galing yung positive-positive. Always remember, okay, so, let's say here, okay, Cartesian plane consists of two axes, and the first is horizontal axis called x-axis. So, ang horizontal dito na tinatawag natin is ito, okay? Itong x na to, horizontal siya, okay? And, the second is the vertical axis called the y-axis. So, ito yung y-axis natin. Ayan. Okay? So, ito yung y-axis natin. At lahat ng axis dito is may kanya-kanyang sign. May kanya-kanyang uh, sign. Diba? Ito. Negative. Ito negative. Okay? Dito positive. Ito positive. Okay? Positive yan sila. Ayan. So, positive itong dalawa. Itong dalawa to negative naman sila. Okay? So, saan ang galing yung positive natin? Kasi, itong ordered pair natin, lagi mauuna, always remember, okay? Lagi nang tatandaan na yung unang element sa isang order pair natin, tinatawag natin yung, ano, tinatawag natin yung x. Okay, yan yung x natin. Yung pinakaunang ordered pair dito, sample, let's say, itong positive na to. Yung positive sign na to. So, x yun siya. Okay? x yan, tapos ito, itong isa is y. Okay. Ibig sabihin, yung iba dito na order pair, okay, ay ito at yung mga order pair na to, na sign. Yung nasa unahan, x stand for x. Yung nasa ulihan, or second um, order, pair, uh, second pair ng order natin is the y. Okay? Yan yung y natin. So, lagi nang tandaan yan na mas mauna talaga yung way natin. So, as you can see here naman, ito, ito yung coordinate natin. Ito. So, the coordinate of this point is negative 3 and positive 2. Okay, this is an order, okay, order pair. Now, let's say, okay, so, ang tawag natin dito is the coordinates of point. So, since point to, walang nagre-represent na any letter. So, point lang tawag natin dito. And later on, ma-explain ko yan sa inyo pag meron na siyang uh, tinatawag na, ano, uh, na kung may nag-represent nag, uh, na doon sa point na yun. Kasi, actually, we can, ano, uh, pwede tayong maglagay dito na kahit anong uh, letter. Sample, let's say, uh, point P, point L, point M. Okay, sample, the point, uh, point P is... Uh, the coordinate of point P is negative 3 and positive 2. So, simple as that. So, lagi lang natin tandaan yan. Ito, kung makikita niyo dito, dito, bako tayo mag-proceed para at least talaga yung knowledge niyo dito sa Cartesian plane natin is uh, mas ma-enlighten and mas ma-improve natin. So, itong x natin, as you can see here, x, okay? So, i-direct na lang natin dyan, ayan. x to y. Okay, lagi mo muna si x sa lahat ng order pair natin. Andito yung x natin at, y, at, at andito yung y natin. And, ayan, 2y. Okay. So, sa pala ganyan, dito, mas nauna yung negative natin at ang negative natin na dito na side, sa left side, yung x natin sa left side is 
pas uh, is negative okay dito sa right side is positive sa y axis naman natin ang going upward positive ang going out uh, ang going downward okay is negative okay now let's say we have this point okay so ano ba yung coordinate okay what is the coordinate of this uh, point okay let's say this is point uh, point m okay pangalan na natin para at least mas klaro sa inyo okay hindi ko kasi masyado makontrol yun natin yung mouse natin kaya sometimes nagkakaroon talaga tayo ng uh, andito na no? medyo nababagalan tayo so let's say this is letter p okay so point p na lang sabihin na lang natin na this is point p so the question is ano ba yung uh, coordinate of point p so first mag-start tayo sa x so since x dito okay ayan wait lang siya dong hindi siya masyado makontrol okay x so this is x and from 0 since x yan makita niyo yung ano natin dito dapat dito sila mag magi-intersect diyan sila magmi-meet okay diyan sila magko-cross kung baga pa sa uh, graphing pa so ito from 0 all the way to this point dito kung saan siya kung saan siya banda so doon kila mag-stop that means from 0 negative 1 all the way to this negative 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10, 11, and negative 12. So, dito siya nag-stop. That means, ayan. So, dito tayo mag-stop. Now, yung, intersect, uh, yung point natin, yung point P natin dito, andito siya. So, hanapin natin from 0, okay? So, hindi naman natin pwede hanapin dito kasi wala tayong point dito. So, dito talaga tayo maghanap na portion ng ano natin ng uh, quadrant 2 natin. Sa quadrant 2 natin, uh, sa quadrant 2 tayo maghahanap talaga. Okay, so from 0 to positive 1 all the way to positive 5 kasi nga andyan. Ayun. So, we have negative 12 and positive 5. So, ang tawag natin dito is the coordinate. Okay, so this is uh, the coordinate of this, uh, the coordinate of point P is negative 12 and positive 4. How about this? Meron tayo dito. Okay. Lagi natin tatandaan na x yung mauna. So, since x, kahit saan mapunta yung ano natin, yung point natin, okay? Yung point natin, x laging uunahin natin. Mag-start ka sa 0, kung saan mo makikita banda yung ano, yung, yung dot natin, dun ka mag-stop. Okay, from 0, okay? 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So, as you can see, yung 9 natin, andito na. Okay? So, hindi ka pwede maglampas dyan kasi wala tayong point dito. Okay? Wala tayong point dito. Since andito yung point natin at dito siya, okay? Dito siya banda sa may 9. So, ibig sabihin dito wala mong stop. Ngayon, x, ito siya. Laging x yung unahin natin. Tapos, ano yung y niya? Saan ba ito? Uh, sa saan ba siya nakaano? Okay. Saan ba siya banda dito? From 0, negative 1, 2, 3, all the way to negative 6. Okay. Negative 6 siya. mag stop tayo dito kasi andito yung point natin. Okay. Andiyan yung point natin. And dito siya banda sa negative 6. Makikita. Ayan. So kung mag-adjust ka, magpunta ka pa ng negative 7, wala naman tayong point dito. So hindi, hindi na siya magmamatch doon sa hinanap natin. So, from positive 9 to negative 6. Ibig sabihin, the coordinate of point or of the point or let's say this is point A. Okay. So, the coordinate of point A is positive 9 and negative 6. Okay. So, simple lang. Oh, simple, simple lang kung paano natin hahanapin yung um, coordinate. Okay. Coordinate of the point. So, ayan, may mga pangalan na rin tayo. Ito, point A. Yun, point P. And, meron pa. How about this? Okay? So, as you can see, meron tayong 7 dito. Dito, banda 7. So, that means, from 0 
to negative 1 all the way to negative 7. And, tignan natin, dito hanggang dito, okay, negative 7. So, as you can see, ito, dito siya naka, ano, sa 7, negative 7. Ibig sabihin, from 0, negative 1, all the way to negative 7. So, ito yung y natin, ito yung x natin. And, as you can see, laging nauuna yung x natin, pangalawa si y. So, let's say this is d, okay? Okay. This is d, point d. And, the coordinate of point d is negative 7, okay, and negative 7. So, this is ordered pair, okay? Now, next, we have this point naman. So, let's say wala na siyang pangalan, no? So, bali ang gawin na lang natin, x tayo, laging unahin si x. Okay, laging yung tandaan yan. So, from x, makikita niyo yung point natin dito. Andito siya kay 5. At, andito siya kay 6. Okay, mas madali, no? Actually, you can start, no, from here. Kung alam niyo yung, kung alam niyo na yung, ano, yung uh, pattern ng gagawin niyo Example, alam niyo na x talaga yung unahin niyo Kahit ang, andito pa yung point, okay? Let me see, kahit andito pa yung point. So, kaya na yung i-determine. Bakit? Kasi from dito, from the point, okay, ito yung mga isa na nakita ko na mas, para mas madali yung maintindihan. From from the point, okay, unahin si x. Saan ba si x? Andito si x, o, oh, horizontal. So, ibig sabihin, puntahan mo siya kung saan yung x mo. So, meron kang 10. Okay, meron ko positive 10. Ngayon, after na puntahan mo na, or na arrow mo na, okay, meron ka ng direction kung ano yung uh, first element mo. So, we have uh, 10. Then, the next element is, punta ka doon kung saan banda si y. So, meron kang 10. Okay, this is just an example. Ha? Okay, so, if sabihin, ang coordinate ng point na yan is 10. Okay, 10. Positive 10 and positive 10. Okay, simple as this. So, as you can see naman, from x, uh, from, from, from the point, so, going to x, ayan, and to d. So, ibig sabihin, unahin mo si x. As you can see naman, 5 siya dito. Meron tayo 5 dito. And meron tayong positive 6 dito. So, that simply means that this point, the coordinate of this point is, okay, as you can see, the coordinate of this point is, um, positive 5 and positive 6. Okay. So, simple as that. Now, next. How about this? Okay. So, it almost here in our example, yung ginawa natin dito. So, andito. So, again, ang gagawin natin, you just start from the point. Okay. Kasi, um, uh, in other, ano, minsan, dito sila nag-i-start, no? Uh, that's okay. Okay naman yun. Na dito ko mag-start from 0, kasi x yung hanapin mo pag ganyan. Then, point mo sa, uh, ano, sa kung saan yung point mo. Then, from 0 to x. Pero para sa akin, mas madali yung uh, gagawin mo kung alam mo na talaga yung, ano, yung tinatawag na mas mauna talaga yung si x at saka uh, uh, ating way natin is pangalawa lang siya sa ordered pair natin. So, sample dito x. So, ang gagawin mo na lang from, from the point, so, puntahan mo na lang kung saan siya na, na ano. Okay, ayan. Okay. Puntahan mo na lang siya kung saan siya nalagay. Ayan. Okay. So, meron tayo dyan. Okay, to be clear, uh, tanggalin natin yung ano, lahat ng ginawa natin. Ayan. So, ayan, meron tayong from this point. So, ayan. Neg uh, meron tayong positive 11. Okay. Ayan. Ayan. So, next, meron tayong positive 10. So, that simply means that this point, and the coordinate of this point is positive 11 and positive 10. Okay, ayan. For this point naman, okay. So, pwede, pwede ka namang mag-start yun lang dyan para hindi ka na masyado mahirap mag-identify. Ayan. So, laging tandaan, x yung lagi mo una at pangalawa lang yung y natin. So, as you can see this, no, this is negative, negative 9 and this is positive 12. So, you can just simply write that the coordinate of this point is that negative 9. Okay, negative 9 and, okay, comma, positive 12. Simple as that. 
And as you can see, pagtanggalin natin to, ganun pa rin magiging sagot. So, meron tayong, okay, from x, negative yan, and yan. So, simple lang, di ba? So, again, I hope na nakatawang sa inyo yung video na to, and kung ba ako palang dito sa channel natin, so please uh, consider do subscribe para mas uh, ganahan pa tayong gumawa ng mas maraming uh, video ng math at saka mas dalian natin yung uh, pag-explain. So, again, thank you for watching this video.